periodic table of elements. What is periodic table of elements? Periodic table of elements is often called the periodic table. It organizes all discovered elements in rows and columns according to increasing atomic numbers. Also, it is where 118 elements are arranged based on their similar properties. Here is a periodic table. Every element has a name. In each box of the table, we will find only one name. For example, nitrogen. One box corresponds to one element. Scientists agreed to give symbols for each element. In this example, the symbol of nitrogen is capital letter N. Element symbols are very helpful, especially to those elements with long names. Instead of writing the full names, a one-letter or two-letter symbol may be used. Symbol is written inside the same box for that element. For instance, N is the symbol for nitrogen. For the two-letter symbols of elements like chlorine, chromium, calcium, and cerium, their symbols start with the first letter of their names. And the second letter are maybe any letter found in their names. For chlorine, L, chromium, R, calcium, A, and cerium, E. In writing two-letter symbols, only first letter is capitalized while the second letter is a small letter. There are symbols that use letters taken from the ancient name of the element. The elements such as iron, silver, mercury, and lead have ancient names. The ancient name of iron is ferrum, and its symbol is Fe. Silver is argentum, and its symbol is Ag. Mercury is hydrogerum, and its symbol is Hg. And lead is plumbum, and its symbol is Pb. So, you already know about the names of elements and their symbols. Now, let us talk about their atomic number. In each box, we will find a number on top of each symbol. This is the atomic number. But what is atomic number? Remember about the atom? Atom is the basic unit of an element. This is nitrogen atom. Atoms have three parts. Those are protons which are positive charge, neutrons which are no charge, and electrons which are negative charge. The number of protons is the atomic number of an element. Let us count the protons of nitrogen. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. The number of protons of nitrogen is 7. So, 7 is the atomic number of nitrogen. Also, in each box, we will find the atomic mass at the bottom of each symbol. The atomic mass is the number of protons and neutrons. So the total number of protons and neutrons of nitrogen is 14, which is its atomic mass. Let us have other examples. This is the name of element beryllium. Its symbol atomic number, and atomic mass. This is the name of boron, its symbol, atomic number, and atomic mass. Notice that the elements are in columns. Those columns are called groups or families. They are the vertical columns on the periodic table. All members of each family have the same properties. There are 18 groups which are numbered from left to right. On the other hand, elements are also arranged in rows. These rows are what we call periods. Periods are the horizontal rows on the periodic table. There are 7 periods, which are numbered 1 to 7 from top to bottom.